You've spent all this time writing a super informative blog post. It's full of thoughtful answers to top questions. It's full of keywords and it's ranking on Google. Life is good. But what if I told you that you can easily turn that blog post into tons of other content to maximize its reach and grow your online presence further? I'm going to show you exactly how to turn your blog post into an audio podcast episode, a video podcast episode, a YouTube video narrated by you without recording a thing. You can create all of this content in just five minutes and I'm gonna walk you through it step by step. The first thing you'll need is a Riverside account. Riverside is a software for video and audio recording and has a top of the line text to speech feature. So sign up and log into the platform. Then on my Riverside dashboard, I will create a new studio. Use this plus button, name your studio. I'll name this one blog repurposing and select create. Now you're gonna head up to this AI voice button. This is Riverside's AI text-to-speech generator. And it's not just any text-to-speech generator. This will generate speech in your voice. Riverside will use past recordings from the host of the account and generate a sound-alike AI voice. You can only create speech in the account holder's voice. You can't regenerate voices from anyone who's been a guest on previous recordings. You will have had to record a few times on Riverside before doing this so that your voice can be recognized and replicated. I will link a video above on that process. So here I have a top Riverside blog post that I want to repurpose. So I'm gonna highlight everything in the blog post and I'm going to copy it. Now with this text-to-speech feature, you can only add up to 2000 characters. So you may need to shorten the post if needed. Here's how to do this super fast. Head to ChatGPT and write the prompt, turn this into 2000 characters or less, and then paste your blog post. ChatGPT is going to rewrite that blog post in 2000 characters or less. Once it's ready, you're going to copy everything that ChatGPT said, head back over to Riverside and paste that blog post. Then you're gonna select generate AI voice. This will process and soon it will be ready to listen to. Platforms like Riverside offer professional quality recordings, capturing each participant in crystal clear detail. If you scroll down on this page, you can simply just download this audio file right here. And then you can head to a podcast hosting site like Spotify for Podcasters and upload it the same way you would upload a podcast episode. If you need a walkthrough on how to do that, I will link a video above for you. Now you can also turn this into an audiogram. This is essentially just a canvas with animated text or a waveform that goes along with your audio file like this. So select edit, and this is the Riverside editor. By default, you will just be editing audio, but head up to this toggle and select the aspect ratio that you'd like. You'll see a canvas appear. Here you can design your audiogram. So let's add a background with this brand button. Select background and you can add a custom color or you can add an image. You can either upload your own or you can choose from any of the ones that Riverside provides. Now you'll want to add dynamic animated captions to keep viewers engaged. Head to captions. Select one that you'd like. And here with this menu that appears, you can change the style. You can change the font, the size. You can change how many lines the caption takes up. And you can choose the animation style. You can also choose the color of both the highlighted word and the main text. Move the captions around on the screen to wherever you'd like. I'm just gonna put them in the middle for now. And to correct a mistranscribed word, you would just highlight over the text in the text-based editor, select correct, retype the word, and select correct again. Now let's add some visuals to this. Maybe you wanna add the blog title. So you would select text. I'm going to copy over this blog title and add it right here. You can change the style, the font, the size, the color and the alignment, move it to wherever you'd like on the screen, and down here along the timeline, you will see this text overlaid over top of the audio file. You can drag that text to take up as much or as little of the audio file as you'd like. So I decided to add the title for the full duration, but maybe you want to add a title for each section of your blog post. You can do that with this text feature and then just adjust the duration to take up only that section of audio. Now, this feels a little bland. So I also wanna add an image. I'm going to head to images and you can search royalty free images right here or you can upload your own. So I'm going to search for podcast recording computer, see what comes up. I'm gonna select this one and it will be automatically added to the canvas. You can move it around the screen to wherever you'd like and adjust the sizing. 
And again, along the bottom here, you can adjust the duration to take up as much or as little of the audio file as you'd like. So you can have one image throughout, or you can add multiple to change it throughout the video. Let's just finesse the look of this a little. It's looking a little messy. Make this a bit smaller. Maybe even smaller than that. So let's take a look at what we have so far. Recording remote video interviews doesn't have to be a headache with glitchy internet and constant interruptions. Looks great so far. Now, maybe you want some music in the background. Head to music and you can choose any of the stock audio that Riverside has here. There are transitions, introductions, outros, all within various categories, or you could upload your own music. Just make sure that this is royalty free. Once your music has been uploaded, you can select it and it will be added underneath your audio file. You can drag it to wherever you'd like. And to adjust the volume, select these three dots, volume, and you can turn it down to a comfortable level to be underneath your audio file. Platforms like Riverside offer professional quality recordings, capturing each participant in crystal clear detail. Pretty cool, right? So you see on the timeline here, there are some silences, like right here and right here. You can remove those with just one click. Head up to AI Producer, set pace, and you can take out as much or as little silence as you want. I recommend a natural or balanced approach. Now you see those silences have been deleted from the final audio file. You can delete sections out of the audio file by highlighting the text in the transcript and pressing delete on your keyboard, and that section will be deleted out of the final audio file. To get the most out of your interviews, you need to understand the best practices for recording, interacting with your guest, and editing. All right, this is looking and sounding great. If you wanted to make this longer, you can add in more AI voice right here directly in the editor. Select this plus button, AI voice, and again, you can add up to 2000 characters. You'll see that it has added the next section right after the first section. The next step would just be to extend those text overlays and those image overlays to take up the full duration. When you're ready, head up to export, and you can export this video in up to 4K. Select go to exports, and you'll see your new video exporting right here. When it's ready, you can click on it, and here you can download the full video to post on places like YouTube, Facebook, and LinkedIn, and even directly publish it to Spotify as a video podcast using Spotify for podcasters. You can also use this AI show notes feature to get a summary, keywords, takeaways, sound bites, and chapter markers that you can use to optimize this video on platforms like Spotify and YouTube. Super cool, right? It is crazy what technology can do. If you aren't using tools like this to speed up your workflow, you're gonna fall behind. If you wanna stay up to date with the advances in video and audio technology, make sure to subscribe to this channel and we'll keep you informed with the latest trends and workflows for video and audio content creation. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments. I answer those personally. If you liked this video, I would love to know, so make sure to give it a thumbs up before you go. And if you wanna learn more about Riverside and what you can do with it, I will leave a playlist of videos here for you to binge. Thanks for hanging out with me. My name is Bridget O'Rourke and I'll see you next week.